what's it like seeing James get this opportunity with his journey in the NFL? He's had to, you know, fight to stay on a roster through the teams that he's been on. Yeah, you know, it's a, it's a good story, and we're really proud of him. I think everybody here is proud of him. Um, it's a good story. You know, I got one from, uh, you know, treading water here for a year, practice squad. You know, he got cut again this year. He was hoping to make the roster, and Houston didn't make it. And then two days later, you know, get put on, got put on the roster up in Denver. So, you know, it's just it's a good story sticking with it, chasing your dream a little bit. And, you know, I always tease him. I said, you know, he's gone from a day-to-day -day contract. Now he's got a week-to-week -week contract. So he's improved his lot in life. But th that is the reality of the NFL. Like all of our guys, you know, not many guys um, make it to the Pro Bowl. We've had plenty, but uh, not many guys go there. And the reality is, you know, it's a temporary profession. But, uh, you know, why not chase it? Why not go after it? And really happy for him. And, you know, Super Bowl is just uh, it's a cherry on top. Do you get a little emotional thinking about how far he's come? Oh, uh, yeah, I do. And it's just, you know, it's just, again, it's a good story. That that's, and we've had a lot of them here. But uh, it's just really proud of him sticking with it. And, uh, you know, he could have turned turned away at any time, and, I, and nobody would have blamed him. But uh, he stuck with it. And, you know, let's see where it all goes. You know, it's fun. I, I coached a couple guys like that when I was in the NFL. Uh, Mike Flynn played for us at Maine. And uh, I don't know how many times he had been cut. We brought him to camp only because we got, you know, just decimated with injuries, uh, whatever year that would have been. 96 or 7 and a couple years later he was a starting center on the on the Baltimore Ravens uh, Super Bowl team so you know when you're around stories like that it's, it's really uh, neat to be part of that and uh, you know I'm a little bit more distant than James I didn't coach James you know face to face that way but uh, you know it's, it's neat to see those stories those are just good stories in sports.